Welcome to pre-math. In this video, I am going to show you an easy way to find which number is larger, either square root of 5 raised to the power square root of 5 or square root of 7 raised to the power square root of 3. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first step. Let's go ahead and square both of these numbers. I'm going to square this one and I'm going to square this one as well. And now let's recall this power rule. According to this rule, we can multiply out uh, these nested exponents uh, on both sides. So therefore, the left hand side number could be written as uh, square root of 5 and then power 2 times square root of uh, 5 and likewise the right hand side number could be written as square root of 7 raised to the power 2 times square root of 3. Now in this next step we are going to use this power rule once again in a backward manner as you can see in this next step and now we can see that this square and square root they undo each other likewise this square and square root they undo each other as well. So this left hand side number is going to become 5 power square root of 5. Now in this next step we are going to take power square root of 3 on this side and likewise I'm going to take power square root of 3 on this side as well. Now let's recall this power rule once again. According to this rule we are going to multiply out these uh, nested exponents on both uh, sides as you can see in this next step. And now this uh, square root of 5 times square root of 3 could be written as a square root of 15. So therefore this number is going to become 5 power square root of 15. And now on the right hand side square root of 3 times square root of 3 is going to give us 3. So this number could be written as 7 power 3. And now let's focus on this left hand side number. And here I have copied down this number. Now we are going to look for a number that is a perfect square and that is very close to 15. And we can see the closest perfect square is a square root of 16. So therefore I can write this thing. I can say this number 5 power square root of 15 is slightly less than 5 power square root of 16. And this number could be written as 5 power square root of 16 is 4. And 5 power 4 is 625. So therefore we can see that this 5 power square root of 15 is slightly less than 625. So we can write this left hand side number is slightly less than 625. And this right hand side number 7 power 3 is equal to 300 and 43. Now we can see that this left hand side number is larger than this right hand side number and since the left hand side number is larger so therefore we conclude that our left hand side number square root of 5 raised to the power square root of 5 is indeed larger than this right hand side number square root of 7 raised to the power square root of 3. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.